very briefly take a look at how to use Snell's Law. This problem says, a ray of light travels from air to liquid, as shown below. Calculate the index of, of refraction of the liquid. And you can see that it's given that air has an index of refraction value of about 1. You can see that this angle is 30, this angle is 22. This liquid, we don't know its index of refraction. That's what we're looking for. One thing you might expect is that if you look at this picture, you can tell that here's the incoming light. If it just kept going straight, it'd go on this path. But it looks like it's going more toward the normal. So this must be the faster medium. And this must be the slower medium, because it's bending toward the normal. So you can expect that this end value is going to be bigger than this end value. We're going to have a slower medium here and a faster medium for the light here. Uh, in terms of givens, let's call this medium 1 and this medium 2. So for medium 1, we know that N is 1. And the angle of incidence is measured from the incident light to the normal line is 30 degrees. And then over here for medium 2, which is the liquid, we actually don't know what the N value is, but we do know what the angle of refraction is, meaning the angle between the refractive ray and the normal line, and that's 22 degrees. So we have three of the four things in Snell's Law. Snell's Law looks like this. N1 sine theta 1 is equal to N2 sine theta 2. We're going to sub in for air 1 times sine of 30 degrees is oops, unknown value, and 2 times sine of 22 degrees. And since, of course, your um, angles are given degrees, you're going to want to make sure that your calculator is in degrees also. Let's find an answer here. 1.335 should be the end value you get for the second um, medium for this liquid. So it is bigger than air. This is a slower medium than the first one. Also, please note that the index of refraction the end value doesn't have any units um, because it's just a ratio of the um, speed of light in a vacuum to the speed of light in this material. So no units on that one.